Oh well, I <laughs> just made it to catch a train. Morning everybody, it is another beautiful day for a ride. It's four o'clock in the afternoon. I just finished my work and have a bit of time to make a short run somewhere near the city. First I have to fill my tank and uh, check the pressure in my tires. No one's looking in the mirrors looking in the phones okay let's fill up the tank let's see if the compressor is working okay. it isn't I have to find another place to check this out okay let's try here Maybe it's working. Let's have so. Whoa. I've got a filthy lamp. <laughs> I've got my tank full and uh, tire pressure was a bit too low, so I have to pump up it. We've got a heat wave over here in Poland uh, in September. It was 29 degrees Celsius today here, so. It's quite hot. I'm in summer clothes and it still is a hot thing when you have to stop for a while and wait on the lights or even for checking out the pressure in your tires. The first stretch is on the motorway, it's uh, 20 kilometers. Afterwards I'm gonna go through some local roads uh, first place I wish to visit today is an, um, an historical railway uh, bridge over the Varta river and uh, second thing are some ruins who guessed <laughs> of a small castle just uh, on the other side of the Varta river not far away from the first location. So let's uh, ride a bit. Oh, and I think uh, I've got my drone back. There will be some uh, aerial footage in this episode. where the bridges have to get somewhere over here yeah, well, I love Google Maps it's always leading me to some strange location okay another type of road I like <laughs> 
and uh, it's the worst one over here oh it's still active <laughs> I saw a train oh well <laughs> I just made it to catch a train It's still in use. <laughs> Don't know much about the bridge. We are building a, a railway line from Poznan to Kluczbork in 1875, and that's the year when this uh, bridge was uh, made. It's a simple um, bridge on the pillars with some steel construction. Joints were made out of uh, rabbits, as you can see over here and still in a good shape and it's still in use as you saw I've seen a train going through it uh, I think it's just for uh, local traffic now I have to get out of here oh there's another train a yeah, small one local got 24 minutes to the next destination yeah, I have to get on the main road and uh, cross the water river here's the nearest bridge in the area I've been just a few kilometers that way 
on the railway bridge I we'll have to go over the Varsa River to the next location Here's some speed camera Oh, I can see the walls in the distance We've got, a, we've got an old church over here with a wooden bell tower and here are the ruins of that place I'm gonna give you short information uh, of that place after I'm gonna fly because I haven't got too much day left and uh, and I, I don't want to lose any light As I told you, a few informations about this place. It was um, a residency of a um, noble house of Palinski. It was built between 1570 and 1592. So it, it's quite an old place. Best years of this uh, place were in the uh, end of 16th century and beginning of the 17th century. Most of the time the residency belonged to uh, one uh, family, the Opalinski family. And the first owner was a uh, crown marshal, state crown marshal, I think. This was the main building. Uh, today's cemetery was a garden. And back there, if you can see behind those trees, there's a piece of wall over there. That was a chapel in the garden. 70, 74, I think, it, it get, went to another family and uh, were trying to rebuild it but with um, not so good finish 1840 most of the, this place was demolished that's how it looks till nowadays this church over here was also founded by the one of the owners of this uh, place of this residency first it was a wooden church then uh, in the 17th century it was burnt and afterwards they rebuilt it uh, 
with bricks only the bell tower is wooden so let's go back to the city it's about 60 65 kilometers it's gonna take me an hour probably today's uh, temperature was quite high I don't remember when we had a uh, September so hot I have to get back to the main road which is over there and probably gonna go with it to Poznan got some beautiful colors of the sunset close my sleeves because it's getting chilly once again through the Barter River huh. long time no see GoPro malfunction <laughs> got some windmills over here if I will be having a possibility to switch from GoPro to another a different kind of camera I gonna probably do because uh, it's quite anno annoying when you always have to deal with the same problems I, then, and uh, the, the, and GoPro isn't even trying to fix those problems I did manage to come back to the city now oh, it's 8 o'clock, a few minutes after 8 There wasn't anything fascinating on the road It was quite pleasant ride in September with such a big temperatures Do not remember well when I was riding the last time in September with 20, 20 few degrees I have to cross the water river again and go home I've got few dead bugs on my visor which way is that? No. okay cops <laughs> okay guys I'm gonna wrap it up for today if you did like it give me a thumbs up leave a comment and do subscribe down below see you next time Thank you.